Day four of the 30 day toast challenge will involve some bread, banana, and peanut butter. So I picked up a loaf of sourdough sliced bread from my local grocery store. It's actually really good. While my bread is toasting, I peel my banana and grab a butter knife out of my drawer, which is conveniently located underneath my cutting board. And ooh, look, my toast is done. Perfect. Yeah, that toast was hot. I bring it back to my cutting board and cut up some of my banana into one fourth inch thick slices, ooze some peanut butter onto my perfect toast and slide that around. Okay, yeah, I know I'm being a little stingy with the peanut butter, but sometimes I feel like there's too much peanut butter and then all I taste is peanut butter and not banana. Now, striking that balance is an art. Next is a not so secret ingredient that makes everything instantly healthier, cinnamon. Cinnamon is rich in antioxidants, reduces inflammation and insulin resistance. The hardest thing about cinnamon is not getting clumps of it all over your banana toast. I know, cinnamon banana toast isn't a complicated fancy recipe, but sometimes it's the simple stuff that really soothes the soul. I like to eat mine with a cup of black coffee. Mm. And what's mm. the verdict? Perfect.